Hello and welcome to another edition of Pokemon Duel. I'm your host, Showtime. Thanks for tuning in and today we're going to have a, a great match. Let's see who we're playing against. It's a ranked match. And we're, going to get, we're going against two Zapdos and a Tapu Koko. Wow. And we have a level 5 Ho-Ho. Wow, I think that was a... a wow, who was that? A Terrakian? Yeah, I think it's a Terrakian. Wow, okay, so we gotta watch out for the, uh, the rush. Uh, he has a type of Coco Rush that can also rush with the, uh, Genesect. I love Genesect because, uh, he has a nice purple. You know, he rolled the purple once, the next time his 50 becomes a 100. It's a really cool attack. And, uh, yeah, so we're gonna try to get our... Tapu, our Tapu Coco up front, and we're gonna put our Sugaleo on the goal. So yeah, so our our Zap matches up really well with this Genesect. So we'll do that. Of course, we won't attack because <clears throat> you know we play defensively. We don't go out for all-out attack. Okay, so it looks like we conceded an entry point. So we're going to put the Sogaleo on the goal. Okay, so we have to now play with one entry point. Okay. What we're playing against Big Mondo. He's ranked 3,000. Okay, cool. Let's bring out a uh, Verizon, just because. Verizon's gonna match up really well with Moltres. Not so well with Tapu Koko, let's, I mean with Zapdos, let's see. We're gonna put our... We're gonna put our Tapu Koko here. And we may have to attack this type of Coco to free up our entry. Okay, he attacks. He's the first one to get aggressive. He likes the matchup. Well, sorry. Wasn't in your favor. Wasn't in your favor. That's one now. Let's see if we can go for the double attack. Should I go ahead and take out his Coco? I think I should. Over with Coco, I win. Okay, great. Alright, so, of course, because the odds are in my favor when I attack the Tapu Coco. I get a weight, but that's fine. I get a free entry. My entry point is open. Very awesome. Okay, so now we're gonna put our Coco in the middle. That's perfect type of Coco placement there. And now we're gonna move our Lunala on the other side. I think we should put a Lunala. Right, let me just double check this Pokemon one more time. I'm pretty sure we're going Lunala. Yeah, we're going Lunala. Yeah, we're going Lunala. He can't win. Alright, so we're going to go Lunala here. We could have also did a Deoxys, but... No. Okay. So we're going to have our Deoxys flank up the right side. And he has nothing to cover. You see he has two Pokemon in the PC over here. So that means it's, it's six on four. So now I can flank up the right side. It's open with a very dangerous Deoxys attack form. So the Deoxys has a clear path, basically. And he ignores it. Let's see, he goes again for the... A typhoon slash. I can switch and put a lot of pressure on him, but I'm not going to. No, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. I mean, it's a thought, but nah. I'd rather, I'd rather go up on the right side with a Deoxys attack form. Let's see how he, how he reacts. Is he going to cover his own entry point? That'd be great. 
I was gonna attack, try to attack. So, let's see. Let's see if I can roll my 130. Oh, he rolled 131. Wow. Let's see if I can get him to re-roll. Let's say he's 101. Nope, wasn't able to do it. Okay, great. So, Deox is on the bench. On the PC. Let's move up our Lunala. We're not going to attack. Because we want to try to get to the goal. Uh, he's in a very peculiar situation because uh, it's 615, but I still have the advantage. If he moves his ho ho here, I can hop over the ho ho. Does he have a gold block? I didn't even check. Oh wow, I think that was the wrong move. He just attacked with his uh, Zapdos into my version. He's in love with that version. I don't know why. So I'm going to put an insane amount of pressure, but he probably has a gold block. Let's see. Does he have a gold block? Hodo jump, hodo jump, gold block. Yes. Alright, so we're going to make him use his whole gold block right now. So who would he going to put on the gold? Is he going to put Terrakian on the gold or the ho-ho? Uh, I don't know who would, who would I put. I think I'd put the ho-ho. Maybe, no, the Terrakian. The Terrakian, definitely. Because he has more dodge. So let's see. Yep, gold block. What are you gonna put? Like, Terrakian? Alright, great. Oh, let's see if I can double chance and win this. I'm gonna double chance and win. So, guys, only use double chance if it's like a really, really pivotal point in the game, like this. This is like really pivotal. Uh, perfect. Moonbeam, Moongeist beam. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright, so the Moon Bice King throws him to the bench. He has one last resort, and that is to attack with his Ho Ho. Ho Ho is a 110, well, 111. Uh, so basically, I have to miss. I definitely have to, because the, what's the Flame Charge do? Nope, I have to miss. The only way for him to beat me is if he attacks me and I miss. Oh, he has another X attack? Wow. Wow, I stand corrected. Calm down, calm down, Showtime. I stand corrected. Alright. Oh, it's a draw! It's a draw! And we take the game. Big Mundo, 3,142 trophies goes down by 2,700 player. And he rage quits. You see him? The other party's correcting. Okay, thanks for watching. We win another match, another game. Thanks for watching Pokemon Duel with Showtime. Really appreciate if you like, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I really want to help grow the channel. Let's try to get this video to 10 likes. Thanks a lot. Have a good day, guys. Bye.